Eyewitness News is tracking breaking news out of Fall River. A short time ago, former Fall River City Councilman Leo Pelletier entered a guilty plea in court to illegal gaming charges, getting two years probation. Eyewitness News has been tracking the story since April 2011 when Pelletier was first arrested, along with three others, for running an illegal gambling ring at Internet cafes in Fall River and Fairhaven. Pelletier maintained his innocence when he was indicted last October, but today that all changed. Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan is live in Fall River with more breaking details. Well, that's right. Before imposing sentence, the judge in this case told Pelletier the fact that these illegal activities happened while he was serving on the city council was, quote, a breach of public trust. I'm sorry. Guilty? Yes. Yeah. 2011-1184-2. With that, Fall River's longest serving city councilor, Leo Pelletier, pled guilty to felony gaming charges, including his in involving his internet cafes. The attorney general charged him after undercover police officers posing as patrons determined he was using the computers to organize gambling services and sell lottery tickets. He and an employee pled guilty Thursday, both receiving two years probation. Pelletier faced a possible maximum sentence of 15 years in prison. Now, outside of court, Pelletier told us he didn't know what he was doing was illegal and that he doesn't believe the sentence is a black eye on his reputation. Never in my mind that I felt that this was an illegal business or else I wouldn't have done it. I don't know. People take me for what I am and uh, I, I think some people will feel that it is. And other people say, eh, that's Leo. Didn't try to hurt anybody. Authorities did seize over $100,000 in cash from those gambling cafes. That probation period, by the way, begins immediately. Live in Fall River with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.